It wasn't what the fisheries minister was expecting. 30 concrete cubes, each weighing 10 tonnes. I, I just couldn't believe how big they are until I came to see them. I had, a, had seen photographs but didn't realise just how big they are. The idea is to place them deep in the ocean where they'll act as a new breeding ground for marine life. 30 will be arranged about 5 k's and another 30 off the Dunsborough coast. It's a W configuration. So um, each module will be deployed about 10 metres apart. Heiju Group won the contract for the $2.4 million project and the modules are being built here at MJB Industries in Australind. We've manufactured some strange stuff but nothing like this and, and we saw it as a challenge and a Oh, I think it's a stepping stone to get into more structural precast. All 60 modules will be finished by the end of this year and put into the ocean. It will take about a year before they become covered in coral and marine life. And if they do help boost populations, we could see many more like this off our coast. Rebecca O'Donovan for GWN 7 News.